Hello, in this tutorial we're going to look at how Photo VCarve designs can be imported into VCarve Pro and combined with engraving and VCarving toolpaths. For example here we've got two separate Photo VCarve designs that have been imported. We've got some vector clip art that's been engraved and VCarved. We've also got some text. And finally we've run a form cutter around the outer, outer edge to give us a finished picture frame. So if we close this design for a moment, so file close. Just going to open the design, the basic design. So we have a, a frame that's 20 inches by 12 inches, half an inch thick. We've got some text. We can edit the text. So if we select the text, edit, we can change the names, change the fonts change the height of the text etc. Let's say we wanted this text to be exactly 0.6 of an inch high. Apply. We can pick the text up. Move it to the position we want the text. Next we're going to import the photo VCarve designs. Here we've got the VCarve design of the baby girl and the boy. Both of them have been opened in the photo VCarve software, sized to be 6 by 6 inches square, toolpath calculated and saved as a PVC file. So if we imp import the baby girl, the grayscale thumbnail appears. If we click with the left mouse button, it turns a, 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 a light blue, indicating the object is selected. Click a second time, we can now move or drag the design to wherever we wish it to be. If we import the second photo VCarve design, so the little boy. Click once to select, second time for interactive placement and moving. Now we can mirror these objects as well. So if we say mirror, so let's just flip that horizontally so that the two children are facing each other. Move them slightly, slightly apart. If we look in the three-dimensional view, we'll see that we've got the the photo VCarve designs. So we have the baby girl and the baby boy. So we can switch these on or off. Twiddle the design around. We can simulate these. So preview preview the little girl, so preview and the boy preview we've already calculated the toolpaths for the text, but just to show you if we select the text calculate preview the text and also the, the border toolpath and the cutout toolpath have been calculated so we can preview these as well so preview all delete the waste material that gives us our picture frame we could also import some additional decoration so if we go to the two dimensional view close the drawing tab import here we have a, a piece of clip art that's come from the vector art collection some flower, flower decoration with that selected calculate a new V carving toolpath use the 90 degree V calculate preview this toolpath you'll see that there we have the, the completed picture frame with two photo VCarve designs again we can save these now so both of the photo VCarve designs have been calculated for a 60 degree engraving bit they can be saved into a single file to do that we'd select one of them or switch them both make them both visible toolpath save output all visible toolpaths to a single file so the baby girl and the baby boy both toolpaths can be saved to a single file the other toolpaths are different tool geometries they would have to be saved as separate files unless you have an automatic tool changing machine so we've shown how we can import photo VCarve designs drag them around and place them and then add decoration and engrave or VCarve to make complete products. 
You can also estimate the complete machining time for the whole project. project. So it should take around about an hour and 20 minutes to engrave both of the pictures and the text and the decoration plus cut the finished thing out so we have a, a product in about 1 hour 20 minutes thank you for watching the video